How is everybody doing today? My name is Master Zero, and welcome back to another reaction video. This time we're reacting to the second most deadliest virus on Earth by In a Nutshell. All right, so I was literally wondering like where, when the next Gertz to Get video is gonna come out and stuff like that, and lo and behold, they blessed us with another one, which is really, really cool. And it's something that really, really interested me, like another video that I reacted to, you know, like the most dangerous virus in the world, but this one is the second most dangerous. So I guess if we already did the most dangerous, we gotta work our way down. But like, I'm really, really fascinated nonetheless, man. It's just really, really exciting stuff. Well, like like I say all the time, when, like in a nutshell, if it has to do with space or body, count me in, man. I'm 100% on board and it makes me ponder like literally me so without any further ado here is the second most deadliest virus on earth okay Few starting of off strong evolution created have been What's so up with the screaming at hurting us as the very okay virus, I, uh... responsible for smallpox the music cues on point man so terrible and merciless that it compelled oh. humankind for the first time okay to truly globally it was Got one it. of the greatest winds of our species god speed creepy virus thing all made possible by cows uh, i'm sorry the cows be pooping uh, you should put that down monkey you don't know where it's been variola i do like the design of the variolas though only seeks to reproduce I mean, all itself the design of in a nutshell of it has been found in egyptian mummies oh. and then writing from india and china as old as three thousand years one thousand is a small box years ago, someone told me that the video i reacted to hey, hey i was right by the I was getting there, okay? It was one of the major My brain's not as fast as yours. Worldwide. In late 18th century Europe, it killed 400,000 a year. Every That's kind of a big number. Oh, birds! Did so because of this virus. Even in the 20th century, a hot second ago in history, it yeah, still that's killed not that at least far. 300 million people. Oh, smallpox is an abusive monster that returns Seems like over it, yeah. and over and over again, killing, maiming, and disrupting society. Oh man. How 500 million, not so another one more. Deadly for so long, we should know this. And how could we have forgotten its horror so quickly? <laughs> in 2020, like, don't turn around, there are only or maybe two do. Left where the living virus is officially stored for maybe just kill it in entirely. Kosovo, Russia, uh, that makes sense, Atlanta, research. USA, hey. which is certainly a good Very idea. Very Because what could possibly go wrong? Let's say that that's literally what I was talking about. Series of events, the virus got out, and you got infected. Let's what not think about you? that. You wouldn't have a video, how I guess. Smallpox kills. Oh, jumping straight into it, I got it. It is highly infectious and catches a ride in small droplets you breathe in. Immediately, it begins to infect the cells that line your throat and starts killing them to cause chaos. Oh, Why? good question. To trick question. your body into giving it a lift. Whenever cells in Explain. your body die a violent death, your immune cells... Uh, all of these things are so the smart, man. To help out. In this case, that backfires horribly. As immune it's cells literally begin like taxis, cleaning up dead cells, eating viruses and killing infected cells, variola infects a crucial cell of your immune system, oh. your dendritic cells, intelligence cells that gather get information out, and leave the battlefield to get help. They enter your lymphatic system, a highway network that spans your entire body and oh. connects hundreds of immune bases. That's poison ivy. In these bases, I'm a plant your heavy defenses are activated and should be the last place an enemy would want to invade, oh. but variola wants to get here. For about 12 that days, is so the smart, though, man. infects civilian and immune cells, jumping from cell to cell, infecting more and more of them. At some point, spreading cryptobismol along the way, and variola starts its attack for real. Millions what do you mean for real? They haven't started. Lymphatic highway to spill into your blood oh. and organs, infecting your whole body. Oh, that's a little Suddenly, bad. Variola is everywhere. You don't say, buddy. But despite this global attack, your adaptive immune system is struggling to wake up. Your immune cells look for and use critical transmitters called interferons to mobilize oh. the body against viruses. What? Interferons, as the name suggests, interfere. Significantly <laughs> you slowing don't down say. virus infections, but also quickly activating millions of antivirus weapons. But variola is able to deactivate interferons, which stuns the antivirus side of the system. I'm defense sorry? System. Other systems would usually help, like the complement system, yeah. a sort of mobile minefield. I love that, that they like taught viruses. us all of this stuff in the but past variola already. Manages to shut oh, okay. this down too. Getting and a little so big, buddy. With little resistance, variola spreads everywhere and infects billions well, of yeah, cells. Well, yeah, nothing in your body could your stop body. it, dude. Among the infected are your capillaries, the smallest yeah. blood vessels in your body, which oh. die in great numbers. Oh, all this death activates little spider things going on that you really don't need right now, but that's attracted by death, the oh. neutrophil. <laughs> Neutral being an efficient killer of invaders, great and small, it's not very effective against smallpox. 
And even worse, neutrophils fight by vomiting deadly chemicals, which kills even more of your cells. Oh, wait, that's bad. <laughs> on top of that, they order inflammation. <laughs> I was not, like so fixated on like trying to kill the smallpox tissue. dudes. All over your body, as first millions, then billions of your cells die, you get a rash and that only gets billions. worse and worse. The B. Pus and cellular junk fills it up as your body swells up like with pus. hundreds of lesions too all many over pimples your skin and inside, even on your organs. All filled oh. with billions of varioliviruses. Now the critical oh. phase begins. Every time as I show the duck, I feel survival, worse. You burn up in a high Who cares about humans? Thousands oh. of battlegrounds drain your blood of fluid oh. that streams into your tissue and organs. Oh. Blood clotting appears all over your body, while floods of toxins from dead cells build up and can cause organs to fail. Your lungs fill up with fluid, making oh, it you're still and harder going. To okay, interesting. One of two things happens now. That you're Either done your with the organ failure. Wrestles back control. Oh. Heavy weapons have been dispatched, killing infected cells, promising up the thousands yeah? of infections one by one, killing variola wherever it can be found, <laughs> so you can slowly though. begin to recover. The immune system will forever remember variola, I don't jinx it. making oh. you immune forever. Let's go. You die. Uh, overwhelmed by the infection and your immune system's panicked reaction to the body-wide infection. About a third of people who can box don't survive. And Neat! You survive, There's the butt I was waiting by for. Scars ...and may even lose your eyesight or hearing. I'm sorry, I don't want to lose my eyesight. Years, this terrible disease Kinda ravaged need that. the world, leaving death and destruction, traumatized and God, many that is something else. Until one day, humanity said, enough. Let's go! Why don't we have smallpox anymore? And this is the Small video that I reacted to not too long ago. Humanity has ever known. The 500 murderous, million and not found another destroying, one. Destroying life ruining monster. Yeah. There was nothing you could do for the infected, but people noticed that if you survived, you were immune. So out of desperation, they came up with the dangerous practice of variolation. Take scabs oh, from an infected person that, that had marks case sense. of smallpox, let them dry out, and grind them to a fine powder. Oh, I then didn't expect it to go this hard. I thought it was just like, skin. yeah, everybody gets infected. If things went well, they only got a mild version of smallpox and gained immunity. Vaccines! Disease. Vaccines! Variolation oh my god! worked because it introduced variola in a part of the body the virus wasn't prepared for. Disabled so I was right in the last video. Tricks. That's beautiful, and because man. the inoculation was left to dry out, that damaged the virus so it couldn't cause the full disease. Dude, that is so awesome. Of Go humans, man. Died because they got the smallpox or yeah. suffered other diseases as a result of treatment. I am so sorry. Still, smallpox was such a horrible and to some degree unavoidable yeah. disease that like, people took the risk to for themselves the good and, and the bad, children. You know? Variolation spread around Definitely the globe the children. while variola continued to kill millions. A victory over but the virus only became a real possibility when scientists realized that it wasn't necessary Those are the to real guys from the video the real smallpox disease yeah. but much safer to use material from cowpox a variant that affected Sorry. surprise cows a truly revolutionary step and only a few years later that is led to so one of smart humankind's most outstanding achievements vaccinations the innovation let's was simple. go man Instead this is so awesome i love like when something system, from my past connects with something i'm cowpox let's go cows mild, but also gave you immunity <laughs> still it would take another 200 years, oh, countless individuals 200. fighting the monster where they could, but wait, there's more to the most remote places on Earth. There it is. All the while, right. the disease ravaged on actual vaccines that we know and love. Million people in the 20th century alone. Well, smart in 1966, people. the World Health Organization decided that humanity had to come together in a final major effort. Teamwork makes a dream work, baby. A smallpox news network based hey. on residents in hotspots was created. See what happens when like we work together, dude. Virus. And like everybody Cases jokes about it and shit, but come on! Given, preventing further spread. Nice. Smallpox only infects humans, so if we stopped yes. the human transmission chain, oh. we would starve the virus. The last natural infection was in 1977, and in 1980, just shy of 200 years since the first vaccine was used, smallpox was declared eradicated. Let's Very go, early, man! The scourge of humanity like, was dead. That's actually V Day. No children would be killed by it. Oh, no beautiful! Or brothers or uncles or cousins. Let's keep it that it's way, please. It's hard to convey to people around He's today what an incredible win this was. One of the cruelest, most dangerous monsters that has hunted us for literally I was shocking. was slain by us. Apes with pointy needles. Let's go, apes with pointy needles. Today, we live in Caesar was right. None of us alive today guts. are haunted by the specter of smallpox. Can you imagine, though, if we never established natural. vaccines? It was set in the sky by the sheer will of humankind wanting to be safe from the monsters haunting us. Let's go. But because we live without them, we forget that they ever existed and that they are real. Get complacent.
that Everybody's the diseases struck might with reawaken, it. or new That's ones true. might be brewing in jungles, oh, wet can markets, you or laboratories, mutated smallpox. It'd be we large pox. What an incredible gift vaccines oh. are, and how hard we had to it. battle to get them. Hey, we are fight still back. protected by the light, but it's back cooling even. each and every day, and we owe it to those who will come after us to make sure it doesn't go out. We killed one monster. Yes. We can do it again. Amen, brother. I love that. This video was supported by Open Philanthropy. Oh, Open Philanthropy. Do you want to continue learning about the fascinating world of biology? Kind of. We've got you. Let's take a real close look at the human body. You got this it. This is an arm, and this I is see. a human cell. Mm -hmm. The microscopic stage where Oh, I could totally happens, see that. Where all the important battles are fought and where you are constantly built over and over again. Which is nuts Even to think about. Even though the smallest unit of life, the cell is extremely complex. But don't worry, we managed to fit everything you need to know on a single Now that's poster. giving me PTSD of, of course, that test fashion, that I never passed it's in easy to understand science and class. Easier on the eyes. That is dope as hell, though. Grasping a complex topic I love the is detail much easier when it's presented in exciting ways. Exactly. The was researched and that's why I love your channel. With molecular biologist James Gurney. So it's expert approved and contains all the latest cutting edge science about organelles, their function, right on, and their place in the cellular world. Approved. We love bringing we're actually teaching you the real shit. Videos, what that means? <laughs> and we're so excited whenever we get to do it literally. Where's my plushie? That's why I we still take got hundreds of hours to create our science posters, all researched with care and crafted with love by us here at Kurzgesagt. We love having such a curious audience, and we want to inspire you and all the burbs in your life to burbs. learn all about biology, space, humans, and life itself. Get the human cell poster now exclusively on the Kurzgesagt shop. That is dope. Support the Kurzgesagt I want one like the size of my wall. Curiosity. Never change, Cursed Cat. You're amazing, man. I love it. Hey, 500 million, but not a single one more. I was right. All right, so kind of like how I talked in the video, man. I love it whenever like something that I reacted to in the past, like heavily applies to something I'm reacting to in the present, you know, like it's so freaking awesome how that happens. And it's like, you you could step back and like take, look at it like on a broad scheme of things. It's like in life, you know, like your past experiences, that's the same way as like science or like, again take a step back like school or just like as a human in general you know like all of your accomplishments um, accomplishments or failures like te it helps you learn and it teaches you along the way and stuff like that and like you take that aspect and i'm getting really deep in this video <laughs> in all the wrong reasons but man i don't care i love that feeling you know and it's just so freaking awesome and then like you escalate it even further you know like I, that 500 million but not a single one more video you know like that sparked my interest in this and like i had no idea it was about smallpox and then y'all guys in the comments informed me it was you know and then like this video comes out and like really really establishes it like what smallpox was like as like a not the fictional side of it you know but like the non-fiction the real like what we went through and stuff like that like that is awesome man i love that with a passion dude and it's just so freaking awesome and like obviously like the animation you like give me little ducks and stuff like obviously i'm gonna digest it like way better like in a nutshell is like phenomenal at doing that dude like that's one of the my favorite things that they do like on this channel is just like it helps us teach like very important things about like what we are like biology wise or like in the grand scheme like cosmic scale you know like it's, it's just so cool having these questions like like asked for us you know like that's what's really cool about this channel so i'm gonna stop babbling i'm just gonna tooth their horn like a lot but like all in all fantastic work i love this stuff so much man so thank you everybody so much for watching leave a like down below subscribe ring the bell become a member you get videos a day early and check out the merch so with that said i have been master zero you guys have been fantastic and i'll see y'all in the next episode later days